Display problems can be a sign of a minor firmware-related issue, especially if it occurred shortly after an update. However, it is also possible that there is an issue with the hardware, that's why it's important that you troubleshoot your iPhone as soon as possible. In this video, we will show you what to do if your iPhone 11 started having delayed touchscreen response after the iOS 14 update. First solution, close background apps and force restart your iPhone. When apps are acting up, there's a great chance that the entire system functions get affected. Apps that usually ended up going rogue are those that were left suspended or running in the background for long. When this happens, various types of problems can be triggered and atypical screen behaviors are among them. Swipe up from the bottom of the screen and stop at the middle. This will show you the app previews. Now, swipe up on every app preview to close all of them. To force restart your iPhone, quickly press and release the volume up button, and then the volume down button. Immediately after that, press and hold the power key for 10 seconds. This will trigger your iPhone to turn off and then power back on. When the logo shows, release the power key and wait until the restart is done. Once the reboot is finished, try to see if your iPhone still has delayed responses. Second solution, reset all the settings of your iPhone. If the first solution didn't fix the problem, then bring your iPhone back to its factory settings or default configuration, by resetting all the settings. This is one of the most effective solutions against firmware-related problems that occurred without apparent reason. This is how you do it. From the home screen, tap settings. Find and tap general. Scroll down to the bottom of the screen, and then touch reset. Touch reset all settings. If prompted, enter your security lock. Tap reset all settings at the bottom of the screen, and then tap reset all settings again to confirm. Your iPhone will reboot after this, once it has finished rebooting, try to see if your iPhone now responds properly. Third solution, factory reset your iPhone. If your iPhone still has delayed touchscreen responses after the previous solution, then it's time to reset your iPhone. A reset should be able to fix this problem, but before you actually do that, make sure to create a backup of your important files as they will be deleted. When ready, follow these steps to reset your iPhone. From the home screen, tap settings. Find and tap general. Scroll down to the bottom of the screen, and then touch Reset. Tap Erase All Contents and Settings. Tap Erase Now. If prompted, enter your security lock. Tap Erase iPhone at the bottom of the screen. Tap Erase iPhone again to proceed. Now enter your Apple ID password, and then tap Erase to proceed with the reset. Wait until your iPhone has finished the reset, and then set it up as a new device. I hope that this simple troubleshooting guide has been helpful. Please support us by subscribing to our channel and enabling notifications. Thanks for watching.